So I think, hi, hello. I just got to see Owl. If you can't tell, I still have me. I'll probably do makeup later. Um, the plan right now is to go get some food and some coffee and maybe write a little bit and I'll do makeup. Then I'll go see who's hanging out at the con center and see if I can hang out with anybody. And maybe head to like H Mart and get some snacks and stuff for my room so I don't have to worry about grabbing food all the time. And that's the plan. It's the fit. It's not very exciting. We're just gonna go get coffee, so. Food has been acquired. I went to Nana's green tea and I got salmon and I got their matcha soda. And I'm really excited, so. I'm gonna chill for a second and then I'm gonna go outside. <laughs> so, I will see you guys. The lighting's in here. We're gonna have to figure out the lighting in here, but. Alrighty, I will see you guys later. Okay. <sighs> I had to go to Target and get deodorant because I forgot to pack some, so. We're back and we're probably gonna head out to the convention center here soon so i'll take you guys with me so we can see what it looks like for the first time together i already have my badge though so we'll see if they let me in hey it's comfy girl for day two i'm excited we're gonna hang out and i got some kangs to hang out with and it's gonna be a good time i'm excited so let's go Welcome to the Time Variance Authority. You have been deemed a variant. Report to the TVA. Not to just get ready in the bathroom and then forget to film all day, but I'm still really bad at vlogging. So I'm gonna try to vlog more today. Yesterday I was with the Kang, so Kang and Hee Remains, which is Chris and Ugo, and they were amazing. And it was so much fun, and I'm really excited to share those, if I have not by the time I actually edit this together, um, shared those yet. Um, I'm excited for it because there was some really cool stuff in there that I haven't gotten to do before. But I want to <laughs> tell stories from yesterday before I forget them. So one of the stories was um, the only place in this new con center to hang out is like the elevators. And I was like, well, when I did Loki back in the day, uh, we did get help and we had to film in the elevator. And... <laughs> I was like, if you're going to film in an elevator, you're going to get stuck in an elevator for a while. So we did, um, and we were there for like 30 minutes chauffeuring people because when you call an elevator, you only get that one elevator. So since we had the elevator, it was the one being called. Um, and people were super sweet about it. We were like, they were like apologizing. And I was like, no, we are like stealing the elevator. Like we will move for you. You don't have to accommodate us. Like we understand what we're doing. Um, but... We filmed a cute little scene with Sylvie and He Who Remains, and that was really fun, but it was literally just like stuck in an elevator for 30 minutes trying to film. Um, it was so much fun though. And then, um, speaking of elevators, we were taking photos by an elevator earlier in the day, and Ugo was setting up the shot, so he's standing there as Kang, being very menacingly, like trying to figure out lighting and getting photos and stuff, and <laughs> elevator doors open and he just turns to them and starts delivering like a Kang monologue to the point where like the people, I don't know, they like weren't coming out of the elevator. It was really funny. So I had to be like, okay, stop scaring them, please go. <laughs> like, it was very cute. It was a lot of fun. There's not a lot of Loki series cosplayers here, but people were very excited about our little group, which was cool. And it was a lot of fun. And I'm really excited about the stuff we filmed and I'm so thankful that they let me tag along. It was such a good group. I'll tag them below and stuff and like the, all their socials so you guys know where to follow them but i wish i had filmed more but i was so immersed in everything that i forgot to film so that's on me um it was really fun we got to do some scene recreations we took some skits and i had a really good time today's our five minutes death day i don't know if i'm gonna go to the panel i'm not a panel person but i did miss um race Darby's show when he was in town when he was doing his comedy tour um, because of some unfortunate events. So I would like to see him in real life, but I am going to the photo shoot because my friend's running it. So I'll try to get some footage there. I'm still not sure how I feel about the con center. 
because I feel like it is very small. I think it will be really good for, I don't know if I've said this already, I think it will be really good for PAX and I think it will be really good for business conventions. I don't think it's a good anime convention or like con, like cosplay. If you have cosplayers going, you probably shouldn't be in that con center. Um, it's so warm and the like, area to actually go outside is so tiny. So it's uh, a little rough, but we'll see. We'll see, today's gonna be the really busy day. So we'll see how much I like dislike it. Cause like they have half of the outside area blocked off for lar uh, for LARPers, which is cool. I'm glad they get an outside area, but it's like most of it. And they only use a tiny corner of it. So I wish they would like push that so more people could stand outside. But I will try to film more today and then I will catch you guys up later. But I'm gonna finish this makeup so I can film some other videos. That's something that, that Steve tries to embody is, is respect and kindness. Yeah. Which is so important in today's world. It's the one thing we, we've really got to work on is just simply to be kind. <laughs> yeah. Above everything else. Because if you have that, then everything else going forward, if you've got that in the back of your mind the whole time, then you won't create hate in any way. And so I think that's really important. That's what Steve embodies. <laughs> uh, but of course, helps when he's getting stabbed and killed that uh, you know he can retaliate with his amazing skills. 